All right, wow, listen to that synth. Okay, got another indie I wanted to check out. This one kind of having a first-person shooter uh, sci-fi vibe happening. Don't know anything about it? L screenshots looked interesting, gonna check it out. It's called All Would Cry Beware. So like I said, this is on Unity Engine. Uh, let's just checking out the options. Okay, there's our res. All right, everything's cranked out. I might just dial this back just a touch. Okay, we'll leave it at that. Um, yeah, always down for any of the sci-fi first-person shooters, and some of the indie ones can be really good. This one, uh, man, like I say, I don't know a lot about it. God, I couldn't even... I Is it early access? I think it is. I should have checked before I even looked, fired it out. But anyways, let's do it. Let's check it out. Now, if you're new to the channel, one thing I will say that I do uh, like to do these gameplay videos, especially on a lot of indie games on Steam, uh, it is a great way to kind of branch out the channel and meet a lot, meet different people this way. Otherwise, I'm usually doing my streaming on the weekends and definitely have games that I try to stay consistent with. Pick a slot and go in the middle. Go in the mids. Down the bombed out streets of ruined LA, you ran. The kill gang in hot pursuit, it seems you made a wrong turn. Oh boy. Perhaps it was simply a uh, survival instinct that led you to seek shelter. But perhaps it was fate, which led you to seek shelter in the derelict offices of Wayfarer Incorporated. A damsel with a uh, dulcimer? What? A dulcimer? In a vision once I saw, uh, it was an Abyssinian Absinian ma maid, and on her dulc dulcimer she played singing... Um, is that an instrument? Oh man, I'm stupid. She played singing of Mount Abora. Samuel Taylor Coleridge and Kamala Khan. Huh. I don't don't know what this Samuel Taylor Coleridge. I should have, I should look that up. Probably an author or something. I have no idea. It's probably like some sci-fi author or something. Okay. So we're in Wayf Wayfair Corp. That's cute. Oh, it looks like we. <laughs> I'm sure. I guess we did that. Lock lock the uh, kill gang out. Uh, so like I said, was saying this is in Unity Engine. What this? That heal me? I'm gonna assume that healed. Sketchy basement. Check that out in a second. What this? Elevator? Oh. Well, I can't resist this. Uh. Give me the gun. Pick up pistol. Okay, cool. Oh. Are those bullets in the upper left? The interface? Oh crap! Interface is very minimal, but that's okay, man. That could be that could be a good thing. Oh, crap. What are you? What are you? Flying Power Ranger drones. Hello, hello, sirs. <laughs> oh no, I love I love the door sound so much. Nice, nice, nice. Ugh, get out of here. Sit down. That soundtrack is something else. <laughs> Hello, people. Hello. Hello, officer. Uh. Yeah, that's what you get. Uh. Yeah, you're out. Now, I hope these are actually bad guys. I don't know if they've actually caused any pain. They look like they're just running in fear. <laughs> What's this? Green key? Okay. Makes sense. That's green key. Oh, okay, that was probably to get through here. And that's the elevator. Hmm. Maybe I need to go back, uh, go back to the store. Since I have a gun, I'm ready to take on that gang that was chasing me. Oh, that's the baiter there. And that just drops down. Okay. <clears throat> Assuming is just healing me. Oh, game saved. Oh, it looks like it's saving as well. Okay. I saw that in the bottom corner. Ooh. Oh! I was supposed to shoot it. Okay, cool. <laughs> I wasn't sure. Then it started flashing. I'm like, okay, I think I think I'm onto something. Game saved. With this computer? Terminal? Uh, view experimental footage, open gate. Well, view experimental footage, or experiment footage. 
You see a video recording of the room you are currently in. Before the steel gate stand 60 men and women. Six of them are dressed in security uniforms, standing behind the computer terminal. Referee, referee where you are now. You can see a technician. There's still time to change your mind, the technician says to the group. You can evacuate with the rest of us. The 16 men and women look at each other. After a while, one of the men in the security uniform speaks. You know as well as I do that this might be our only chance to see if this works. Flip the switch, close the door behind us, then get out of dodge. Oh, God. The security tech uh, reiterates, I just need to make sure, Grant. If you make it, you'll be stranded until we get back to the laboratory. And who knows when that will be? even still standing and that's if this works there's no guarantee you'll survive oh god grant looks around at his 15 companions as if giving one last chance to back out satisfied he turns back to the technician and says it ain't enough to survive we've got to make it interesting the technician sighs pa passes a few keys on the keyboard he shouts to a second tech standing in the booth to the right of the gate. disengage locks locks disengage respond to the technician uh, response to technician in the booth who is who is British apparently. Okay. In experiment, the first technician pauses as if reconsidering his words. He corrects himself. Perform the ritual. Perform the ritual. Holy crap. Locks engaged. Lock and gate. Wait, gate must be unlocked before attempting procedure. Oh god, I have to do this now? Yeah, I guess we're looking to teleport to wherever these people teleported out to. That's kind of cool. Kind of like, ha give me some Half-Life vibes. <laughs> God, I love these doors. Okay, we need red key card. Hey, do you guys actually cause damage? Yes, you do. Oh, or something. Oh, yeah, I see my health. My health is the top left. Oh. <laughs> I'm dead, but I can still shoot. <laughs> okay, my health is in the top left. It's those little, little dots there. And these guys, confirmed, can kill. Hello. Eek! You bugger. You bugger. Thank you. I guess we'll check the rest of this room out. Eh. Sucker. I should count how many hits. What is that? Three? I think it's just three hits to get him. Oh, this is the other side of the duck. One, two, three. One, two. Meow. Oh, boss! Security mech! Oh, Jesus! One second. Just gonna tweak this a little bit. Music can stay up. Music can stay up. It is really cool and, and sketchy. I like the music a lot. Oh, God! He's right on me! Oh, thank God. I can just hold the button down. Good. <laughs> I like his nut gun. <laughs> Boom! Give me your key card. Can I go in your garage? Negative. Okay. I like my pistol. All right, let's do it. Oh, this is the gu the gate. I'm assuming. Disengage, lock. Lock disengaged. Ex oh, we gotta read this. Expedition manifest. Security personnel, Mulroney Grant. Oh, Grant, he's the chief officer. Okay, that's the guy that was talking. Frank Tiger Security, da 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 Science personnel, John Carter. Botany, biology, general physician. Okay. Engineering, engineers. Wow, cool. Getting some kind of system shock vibes as well, that's for sure. Open the gate. Aligning pattern. Pattern aligned. Opening gate. Ooh, here we go. Oh my god, it's scary. I better save. Just in case some sh shenanigans happen. Hey, here we go. Into the gate. Roading. Oh, wow. Yeah, I just I love I, I don't know man these kind of these kind of first person shooters could be really fun. Pick up log entry. Todd, are we dead? Nell, holy shit! <laughs> uh, Todd, I don't feel dead. Although to be fair, I've never been dead before, so I wouldn't know. Oh, you guys are dumb. Grant, we made it. We goddamn made it. You hear the sounds of cheers, Rebecca? We should save the celebration for once we've taken stock of our surroundings. 
good rebecca actually sounds like the smart one i think everybody needs to listen to rebecca grant you're right we are setting foot in the new world after all but god it's a paradise order sir frank grant all right we need to find a place to set up our base camp let's make let's make like the ancient greeks and pick somewhere high up It'll give us a good vantage point of our surroundings. It'll be defensible in case we're not alone in this world. Ooh. Not alone. Okay. Oh, God. I'm just going to assume you're bad, dude. Yeah, you're bad, dude. You're going to be coming at me with your pointy end. Some cave of some kind. Yes, yeah, probably all blocked. Eh. <laughs> Stupid pyramid. <laughs> The aliens are prisms and pyramids and all sorts of weird shapes. Okay. Again, that soundtrack is, is just a beast. I love it. Go this way? Sure, why not? What's this? You open the capsule and the nano machines from a thin protective layer... Oh, form a thin protective layer around your body. Max health plus one. Your body is a wonderland. Oh, you stupid triangles. Prisms. No, you're not. You're not. You're not prisms or triangles. What? I don't, I don't know my shapes, man. My math was a long time ago. That's blocked off. Yeah. At least this guy can jump super high. Use it. All right, it's just gonna be twitchy. That's fine. Oh crap! More pyramids. Oh, another entry. Let's see how the crew's doing. Rebecca, looks like you've got your work cut out for you. Yeah, huh? Oh, yeah, it's fucking terrible. Rebecca, it certainly is. Our bleed. Todd, lucky you. Plenty of plants. No sign of intelligent life so far. Something doesn't turn up, it might be out of a job. Rebecca, I'm sure my, uh, my, my, my work. Yeah, that's what I'm afraid of. And it's happening. I'm sure it's a stone. I'm sure it's a drum. Oh, man, I won't know until the sun goes down and Margaret and I can... Take a look at the night sky. We don't know where we are, how far fast we traveled, how we traveled in the first wave. Hell, if we traveled. What do you mean, if we traveled? Look where we are, dude. This ain't All right, a few minutes ago. Oh, Jerome. I think Jerome's on something. Oh, my God. Well, a few minutes ago, Jerome knows him. Yeah, da, 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 da. I'm going to kind of breathe through this here. Da, da, rush. The message was in Russian. What? The only reason we knew it could work is because we got a message from light years away containing instruction. The message was in Russian. Maybe a human origin? Okay, so we believe we're there, there, there. so far away. Anyone know that? Okay, yada yada yada. Oh my god. Sun goes up. Exactly, man. What was that? Now we get that. Maybe it's the alien argument. Wow. I hear it's hard to believe the plot. Holy crap. Okay. A little bit to read there. Oh no, it's the bilateral pyramids or whatever the hell you guys are. Boom, boom, boom. Uh oh. Ooh, turrets. Go to hell. Oh, Jesus, that hurt. Dude, don't let these things kill you. Oh god, more log. Uh, Nell, uh, okay, hold on. I'm gonna see you somewhere. Jane, take the bloody tiles. No, no, hold on a minute. I got it. Anyone else got an hourglass? Just hear some motion. Someone get the dog. Oh, fuck, what happened? <laughs> we made first contact. It's the pyramids. <laughs> That'll happen. We just, uh, we got jumped by something. Started flying at us. Jason took a nasty fall. You should get away from the hostile. Okay, Jason tried to fall away. Uh, but, uh, did this right. Off a cliff. Some native flew off. Huh. Oh, I didn't finish that. Oh, well. Save. Don't think I can go through these yet. No. They're just going to be twitchy. Oh, wow. Oh, God. All these shapes are bad guys? <laughs> That's kind of funny. Cool. Nice. Call me crazy. I honestly... I love the look of this game. Oh, crap! I think, man, I love, I love the retro... It just reminds me so much of, like, System Shock 1. A lot. Just... Just these like very saturated colors. It's 
The enemies are funny, like shapes, what the hell? Actually, the mech boss was kind of cool. Okay, let's get over there. <gasps> Ooh, I wasn't sure about that jump. Ah! Nice particle effects. <laughs> Ew. This is a very pink planet. Whoa! Jesus, these goddamn pyramids, dude. Nice. Uh oh, turrets. Oh, dude, don't get it. Come on, man, these things move like a mile an hour. That thing's clipped on the wall hardcore. No reason for me to die. Oh, God, I have to. I have to do that? Okay, that's fine, we can do this. Hey, is there something over here? Don't think so. Okay, here we go, here we go. <gasps> Glavin! Oh, hey guys. Ah! Pointy end! Jesus! Too far. This gun has minimal range. Hello. <laughs> ah! Perfect. Anything down there? Ah, oh, who cares? I want to go in here. Oh, blocked off though. Oh, that was probably the other side of the first cave. All right. Boots and cats and boots and cats and boots and cats. Oh, more log? Oh, god damn it. <laughs> it was interesting. In Zenadu? Chenadu? Zenadu? Did Kuba Khan and uh, a stately pledge gnome decree? It took us the better part of a week to set up the youth cabin. Big lead made sure we have the basic necessities counted for. It's far from comfort to earth, but it will relieve the safe inside of the environment controlled. Geodesic dome instead of a flimsy tent. I always want to say Neil, but it's Nell, I guess? I've never met a Nell. Now let's start planting the seed we brought from Earth. Hopefully they will grow soon. A man uh, can't eat condensed ration for only so long. We'll gradually build the other facilities in the coming weeks and months. But for now, we have home on this Zenadu. On this Zenadu. Zenadu. Is that what they're calling the planet? Or is that maybe a term I don't know? I don't think it's... I think it's what they're calling this place. Oh, there's more log up there? Jeez. Oh. I wonder if those are the plants they planted. Uh-oh. Oh, well, okay, there's a save point right there. Ob we know we're fighting another mech again. <laughs> bone fist. Oh, God, it's a bone fist. Oh! Jeez, bone fist! He's so scary. Huh. Ow, fucker. Huh. Glavin. Hello. Oh, yeah, don't let him touch you, dude. That actually hurts. No, dude, don't let him touch you. What did I just say? What did I just say? Ow, that hurt, dude, you're gonna die. I think I can, I think he, oh, okay. We know what's up, we know what's up. This is Dark Souls. Everything, everything is in life is Dark Souls. That's what you have to come to understand. Okay, so I think he can actually approach you and because he just runs right up to you as soon as you, as soon as he finishes his first slam. So, I think he can come up to you. I think you just don't want him to, you just don't want to touch the slam. Don't touch the pink slam. Whoa! Yeah, just keep kiting him. Oh no, that hurts. Dude. Oh crap, okay, this is gonna take me a second. Don't let him touch. Oh, I'm dead already! Oh, dude! Okay, there we go. This is the pattern. This is what I need to do. Yeah, because now he's not coming. Now he's not getting close to me. Ah, stay away, use ugly. Use ugly, sir. Sir, you can't cure ugly. Oh no! No, I don't wanna die. I'm too beautiful. I'm too beautiful to die. Oh, I think I, I don't know. Don't get too close, man. I still got a little bit of health left. Ah! I've only got one hit. Yay! Who's the best? Oh, and you had a gun. Pick up shotgun. Bone fist. <laughs> okay, cool. Oh, I like the shotgun. That's dope. 
Oh, and it can destroy the webbing. Makes sense. All right, we're making progress. I have no health, though. I need to find a save. Please have a save up here. I don't want to fight Bone Fist again. <laughs> Log entry? Oh, my God. Isn't Dano's coming to my mind? What do you see? No. Sir, it's been a week. You know, no, sir, quite the opposite. I feel great. Later, more. It's about this honeydew. Honeydew, that's good. Some kind of random fruit they eat. Mysterious plant with no one affecting my taste. And unofficially. Things blow over back on Earth. Oh, crap. And the boys back home get the portal open again. This could be what will put, put Waypoint Inc. on the map. Huh. Okay. Something about some fruit they found. Probably giving them, like, super cool abilities, or who knows. Hmm. Do I do? I can't get back there from here. I just want to save them. I have one health. Oh, there we go. Thank you. Another log. Oh, my God. <laughs> I would read all this, but man, I'm making a video. Grant, I want to talk about something. Shoot. Did you imagine? You can't understand the picture. Okay. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> okay, that's where I was before. I go back down. No? Oh. Okay. Yeah, I guess we'll just wrap back around, and now we can start busting open some of the places with the other web. With the uh, other webbing. Oh, and you guys respawn? Unbelievable. So inaccurate! Oh god. Oh god. Pyramids. Egyptians! Boom! Bust this open. Ah, hello. Who's your daddy? Who's your... Oh, crap. Who's your daddy? That's kind of the cave we were in before. Boom! Yeah, now this is opening up the first area. Oh, God. Ah. This is where I started. Yeah, that, that is where I started. Yep. Okay. Came through here. We get rid of the get rid of the twitchy stuff. Nope. Twitchy stuff does not go. Nice. Shotgun is a thing of beauty. Can't do these though, eh? No. Hmm. No. Boom! Get out of here. Hello. Good morning. Guess I'm looking for another webbing to bust open. Okay, this is back to this area. Oh god. Crap. Yeah. Get away from me. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, this thing's nice. Oh, I, f I didn't jump proper. Jeez. Still got my shoddy? Yep. And I saved there. All right. Well, I think I'm gonna, probably going to leave it at that. Just keep it a short video. Just wanted to get a touch base on the... Oh, God. What do they even call this game? They I have to even look. One second. And all would cry beware. Very... Which is, is a kind of a nice... You know, 
not, not exactly a catchy title, but it is... You can definitely tell that these guys are going for that 70s throwback. And uh, honestly, I, I kind of like it more than I thought I would. It's got, it's got a bit of a System Shock vibe to it. And man, anything System Shock, I'm just a complete sucker for it. But anyways, I'm going to keep the video at that. Thanks for watching. Um, like I say, I like to do, I'm going to be doing more of these indie game gameplays. Try and keep them quick just to be able to kind of branch out and uh, check out some different titles as well. Anyways, so thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, all that usual stuff. Take care. Have a good one.